Rockaway Boardwalk is an incredible amenity that connects the neighborhoods all along the shore frontier. After Sandy, there were many opinions on what best to do to protect Rockaway and also allow for recreational amenities. There had been calls to consider not rebuilding the boardwalk and putting back here a double dune system in its place. But when the city looked at this long and hard with our Office of Resiliency and Recovery, we thought it was best to rebuild the boardwalk and it's now bigger, it's stronger, and better than it had been before, and it allows for measures of protection that the community had asked for. This project was um, about $480 million. Essentially, it you know, had high impact because one, it impacts an entire community, and the size of construction required for this project in addition to the dollar amount. The original boardwalk, the construction began back in 1927 and was built on concrete piles with wood, timber, and the wood just sat on top of the concrete piles. And when the storm hit, Superstorm Sandy, much of that boardwalk lifted and either lifted and fell back down or actually lifted and floated into the neighboring community. So the new boardwalk is built much more stronger and much more resilient. It's founded on steel um, piles that are epoxy coated. We're built three feet above the 100-year flood level and the concrete, this new beautiful concrete with the stone and the glass inlay in it, is actually anchored to the steel pile, so we are much more resilient than we had been before. They've elevated this up out of the floodplain. They uh, have added a uh, buffer wall on the uh, uh, land side of the boardwalk. Uh, one of the problems before was the water came in underneath the boardwalk and lifted the boardwalk and uh, splintered it and sent it inland. Uh, the water cannot get underneath this boardwalk because in addition to the uh, uh, money to rebuild the boardwalk, we were able to give them uh, uh, hazard mitigation money. They built these, uh, these berms and uh, any water that comes through is going to actually end up uh, coming up the berm and over top. It's not going to go underneath. It's not going to rip this structure apart. We took an approach of collaboration. Um, we definitely went through, went step by step with the um, subgrantee and really worked through the project itself. Every little nuance, every you know improvement, every in-kind repair, hazard mitigation plan, we, we really walked through it with them. Since the rebuilding, the attendance in the summertime, and, and in New York City our beach season only runs from Memorial Day through the week after Labor Day. So in that short time frame, the past two years we've had close to seven million visitors come down, swim in the ocean, and enjoy the new boardwalk very nice it gets very packed here very busy so you know it's good for the neighborhood you know to have people come here you know from other areas I think it was a blessing that's my opinion that this was a blessing Rockaway is clearly on the rebound the people who use the boardwalk they cycle on it they walk on it they rollerblade they go with the strollers not only in the beach season but year-round you'll see people here and that's what we heard from the community most they wanted their boardwalk back.